I wonder how much compassion you'll hear in a country where the leaders spread irrational fear. It's discouraging, if not depressing, to learn that a witch hunt is now our most pressing concern. To keep those Johnnies on their feet, all the stations need border agency bobbies on the beat. Be sure and make the scene loud and clear, because they should be out of here. Go home all over lorries on the street. That's government's best suggestion. Well, such a subversive approach must be entirely necessary, which begs the question, how many illegal immigrants are there in this country? Oh, you don't quite know. So how can you justify the psychological impact of this whole sideshow? Like race relations, disintegration. This is either oversight or misinformation, but control's about taking sides. So it's no surprise you want to roll this out nationwide. Go home harks back to a miserable memory of hatred towards an invisible enemy. And it's wrong of government to use this phrase. It's wrong of government to abuse its place because language is a gateway to an attitude. That's menacing, that's hostile, that is rude. In using those words, you invite the behavior that comes with them. And in doing so, you validate the bigot that runs with them. This is kiddish, it's foolish. It's not British, it's brutish. No one in the country knows how many illegal immigrants there are. 94% of the country know that a lot of illegal immigrants don't look like them. If government can't be bothered to tread carefully, why should anyone else?